Welcome to the Transitions Daily Podcast. Transitions Daily is an online recovery group that offers a daily distribution of popular recovery resources accompanied by a secret Facebook group for discussion. We hope you enjoy today's readings. This is Transitions Daily for January 10, read by Craig M. from Denny, Scotland. A thought for the day. Courage. I looked around me at people who seemed happy and tried to analyse their happiness. And it seemed to me that without exception, these people had something or somebody they loved very much. I didn't have courage to love. I was not even sure I had the capacity. Fear of rejection and its ensuing pain were not to be risked. Alcoholics Anonymous, page 546, does not appear in the fourth edition. Thoughts to consider. Courage is fear that had said its prayers. Acronyms. AA. Altered Attitudes. Just for today, cooperation from the three legacies of Alcoholics Anonymous. Public relations was not a big problem, but a very delicate one. Any blunders that could arouse general prejudice might prolong the suffering of many and cost the lives of some. A careful thought out public relations policy had to be formed and put into operation. Prime consideration was given to our relations with medicine and religion. Under no circumstances must we get into competition with either. If we appeared to be a new religious sect, we would certainly be in trouble. And if we moved into the medical field as such, there would be more trouble. So we began to emphasise the fact that AA was a way of life that conflicted with no one's religious beliefs. We let the doctors know how much we needed hospitalisation, and we suggested to psychiatrists and drying out places the advantage of cooperating with us. Alcoholics Anonymous comes of age, page 197. Daily Reflections. United we stand. We learned that we had to fully concede to our innermost selves that we were alcoholics. This was the first step in recovery. The delusion that we are like other people, or presently may be, has to be smashed. It's Alcoholics Anonymous, page 30. I came to Alcoholics Anonymous because I was no longer able to control my drinking. It was either my wife's complaining about my drinking... Or maybe the sheriff forced me to go to AA meetings, or perhaps I knew, deep down inside, that I couldn't drink like others. But I was unwilling to admit it because the alternative terrified me. Alcoholics Anonymous is a fellowship of men and women united against a common fatal disease. Each one of our lives is linked to every other, much like the survivors on a life raft at sea. If we all work together, we can get safely to shore. As Bill sees it, out of the dark. Self-searching is the means by which we bring new vision, action and grace upon the dark and negative side of our natures. With it comes the development of that kind of humility that makes it possible for us to receive God's help. Yet it is only a step. We will want to go further. We will want the good that is in us all, even the worst of us, to flower and to grow. But first of all, we shall want sunlight. Nothing much can grow in the dark. Meditation is our step out into the sun. A clear light seems to fall upon us all. When we open our eyes, since our blindness is caused by our own defects, we must first deeply realise what they are. Constructive meditation is the first requirement for each new step in our spiritual growth. That's from the 12 and 12, page 98, and from a letter, 1946. Big book quote. We never apologise to anyone for depending upon our Creator. We can laugh at those who think spirituality the way of weakness. Paradoxically, it is the way of strength. The verdict of the ages is that faith means courage. All men of faith have courage. They trust their God. We never apologise for God. Instead, we let Him demonstrate through us what He can do. We ask Him to remove our fear and direct our attention to what He would have us be. At once, we commence to outgrow fear. It's from Alcoholics Anonymous, How It Works, page 68. 24 hours a day. A thought for the day. When we were drinking, most of us were full of pride and selfishness. We believed we could handle our own affairs, even though we were making a mess of our lives. We were very stubborn and didn't like to take advice. We resented being told what to do. To us, humility looked like weakness. But when we came into AA, we began to be humble, and we found out that humility gave us the power we needed to overcome drinking. 
have I heard that there is power in humility? Meditation for the day. I will come to God in faith, and he will give me a new way of life. This new way of life will alter my whole existence. The words I speak, the influence I have. They will spring from the life within me. I see how important is the work of a person who has this new way of life. The words and the example of such a person can have a wide influence for good in the world. Prayer for the day. I pray that I may learn the principles of the good life. I pray that I may meditate upon them and work at them, because they are eternal. From Hazeldean Foundation, PO Box 176, Centre City, MN 55012. This is Transitions Daily. My name's Craig, and I'm an alcoholic. We hope you enjoy today's readings. You can also receive Transitions Daily via email and discuss today's readings in our secret Facebook group. So for more information, go to dailyaaemails.com today. Other than the 24 hours a day reading, unless otherwise specified, all quotes copyright Alcoholics Anonymous World Services, Inc. 1952, 1957, 1967, 1973, 1975, 1976, 1980, 1981, 1984, 1985, 1988, 1990, or 2001.